What's up guys? You know what time it is. We are going to be doing a nice and powerful goodie bag opening. We have 500 big goodie bags. Uh, so before I get into that, I'll just explain the differences between the large and the small. So um, the large one is a little harder to get because it requires a rod of Evandus, which is either worth 10 mil or you can get it from mob drops from the uh, Sutro Queen boss or the actual pirate zombies slash zombie pirates that you find at Cone Corn event. Um, and this one, what it does is it gives you two rolls and 250 points. So whenever you open it, you do get two rolls on the goodie bag table. Um, and then if you get the smaller one, which is the one we normally hand out and the one that um, you get from donating slimy eels, only has one roll and 100 points. So that's the only real difference. Um, it's Even though it's 500 goodie bags, it's actually 1,000 rolls on that table. So it's essentially loot from 1,000 small goodie bags. Let us open a couple together, and then we will just spam open the rest. Unfortunately, because of the item requirements, like we have to do 10 at a time, so this is going to take quite a while, but that's what we signed up for. Move them over here, that'll be faster. Special box, nice. We will open those. Well, uh, there's going to be a special box opening video tomorrow, so I will just leave you with mystery for now, then, I suppose. And then tomorrow, tune in again, and you should have that video for you. I'm not going to do a small opening because, like I said, they're the exact same loots, just you get more rolls with the larger one, so that's why we're doing the larger one. Um, and then let me give you a brief rundown of what is in the actual table. So I don't want to go over this too much, but I will let you guys scroll down if you want. You can or, or pause and, and look at anything you want. This is commons. Here are the uncommon. They're pretty easily, you know, distinguishable. Um... And then here's the higher end loot. So we're going to open up a couple more, and I'm just going to start spam opening these, and we will see what the loots are together at the end. All right, here we go, the last ten. Boom. So, yeah, here you go. This is the loot. Thanks for watching, please. No, no, I'm just, I'm just kidding. Let me, uh, let me organize it a little bit just to make it look visually better. Alright, so this is everything. We got seven special boxes, nine membership tickets. In terms of the big items, we did get... Um, let me look at the table. So for the very rare table, the highest end table, we only got um, Armadale Chain Skirt and the Lucky Title, which is pretty bad, to be honest. I feel like we didn't... We definitely did not get lucky by any means. We hit the rare table quite a, quite a bit. That's the Infinity Kits. The looting bag, the Vorkath head, the um, not the rune pouches, the staff of light, Serdom's sword, elite mystery boxes. Uh, nice chunk of those five. So we hit that table a fair bit, but on the very rare table we only hit it twice. So I suppose theoretically it's one in five hundred to hit that table. It's not though. It's one in two hundred fifty. So we we got we got kind of unlucky. Am I for, am I missing something that is on that table that, that we? I don't think so. I don't think I missed because uh, bunny ears are, are only rare. You can, you can tell we got four of them. The Murf the Murfolk Trident is only rare. So yeah, just two items. That's kind of disappointing, but you can kind of see the variety you get here. And I'm not going to open these. If you want to see those, tune in tomorrow. But thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Oh, also, the Masi, if you're wondering what the new items, I guess I'll go over those. So the challenge ticket's not new, but it was a part of the one of the last events. It basically lets you kill a, the big snake boss, and you can find the big snake boss on the view drop table the uh, masa key is going to be used for a new boss coming out which is similar to the, the to the challenge ticket it is a boss the key will give you one boss kill and that comes out next update so stay tuned for that save your keys until then um the holy force is basically like a slurp juice but for prayer points it um restores your prayer to full but has a one in three chance of breaking so is that, is that it for new stuff i think that's it for new stuff this stuff is just cosmetics uh, Dwarven Helmet is the same stats as a Helmet of Need Snot, but with more crush bonus, and it does disassemble for lucky components. But, um, yeah, these scrolls came out a while ago. These You can use them on clues to get a clue box. Living Minerals have always existed. That's the Tuz currency, if you will. So, But, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.